Whoa, baby. Why are you driving like a NASCAR? You ain't Martin Truex Jr., baby. I'm Martin Truex Sr. Y'all, we're sitting inside. Yeah, they're complaining. What have I complained about? You have, where do you want me to start? We're sitting inside. How great. Because we're late. Because we got lost. Because the co... It's not the co-pilot's fault. It's Capitan's fault. Yeah, if you don't know where you're going and you're yeah. driving, you either need to ask for directions or pull it up yourself. Pull it up yourself. All right, remember that, folks, because uh, next time she's driving, I'm not going to take it upon myself to figure out where we're going. Have y'all ever seen a video in 10 weeks where I'm driving? No, but she needs to drive soon because I want to bitch about it. That's all you do is bitch. You're bitching about me being a bad co-pilot and then you would bitch about my driving. Actually, it's about to all change. We're never going to be in that car again, dude. That's sad. I will spend plenty of time in it. I'm sad. In the field. Do you see beds? Yeah. Commuter or business? B commuters to or from school business. There's none you of this is going you, in there. Why? You think you need a? Okay, first off, it is going. That's in the there. thing. It I is. was wondering, like, is business okay, more? Okay, y'all, we're talking in insurance because stop the car. The I feel like the people in my office are gonna like lose their mind. To him. Yo, this little guy got well, his damn tongue bit off. Well, he bit his own tongue off. Fighting with ducks. He's drugged up right now. But it bled. We couldn't get it to stop bleeding. Like, it was bleeding so bad. This little bastard's tongue got bitten, too. Yeah, so he tried had to, to spend the night at the hospital. It. And now we're picking him up fun stuff and he cost his mom a fucking large chunk of change. We went through a whole roll of paper towels uh, trying to get his tongue to stop bleeding. That motherfucker was Gershon. Gershon. Got the carpets dirty. Oh yeah, we the whole place whole house is full of blood. Can you imagine if that happened at my house? <laughs> well he's okay. He's okay, he made it. Can y'all smell his face? It smells like uh, something from Burger King. <laughs> Let me smell it. You I mean, do smell, you smell like medicine. <laughs> smell like a butter Y'all, have you ever had, uh, have you ever known someone who had to be talked into going to the pool? I don't know if I've known anybody, but we have to had to talk Clay into coming. Yeah. He's not a fan of being in the sun, which is not fun for me because I want to just bake in the sun. Because your skin is so white. <laughs> 
why don't you take your white t-shirt off? <laughs> <laughs> What if I just drop it? <laughs> I'll stay dry and warm. <laughs> Yeah, did I say earlier I felt like Spongebob? Because I feel like Spongebob. Bold crayfish. They pull them right out of that river right there. No, they don't. Right um, down there. Shoal Creek is a staple in Austin. If you've never been, Shit's Creek. Because uh, it's literally right here on Shoal Creek. <laughs> it doesn't need to be. That's where they get the crawfish. It's not, but um, it's cool. Damn, we're above sea level here. 476 feet. We. Fuck, I was gonna say something. Oh, we got five pounds of crawfish. 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 Damn, already? You got your sausages. You got your craze. You got your potatoes. That one's doing the fucking YMCA. <laughs> <laughs> Mad. Where do you want it?
like it, it just catch the gills. Yeah. <laughs> 